What's up, Dana? Hi, how are you? Quite well. Um, you've talked a lot about the economic impact of the migrant issue. Are there any proactive policy initiatives that you would have taken, undertaken were it not for the migrant issue? And relatedly, are you at all concerned that your rhetoric on the migrants will in any way inflame anti-immigrant you know, sentiment here in New York City? Yeah, well, one, I'm not going to uh, speculate on what isn't. I'm going to deal with what is. I got a $4.3 billion budget. Uh, second, I'm not spewing rhetoric, and I take uh, offense to that. I've made it clear from day one, if you look at every comment that I made, this is not about asylum seekers and migrants. All of us came from somewhere to pursue the American dream. It is the irresponsibility of the Republican Party in Washington for refusing to do real immigration reform, and it's the irresponsibility of the White House for not uh, addressing this problem. Brownsville, Texas, El Paso, Denver, Los Angeles, uh, New York, Chicago, we should not be burdening the weight of this problem. And so it's not about the people who are, su who are pursuing the American dream. It's the irresponsibility of those that are allowing them to come to a country and not build the infrastructure to allow them to pursue that dream. So people who are, are attempting to make it that this is an attack on the migrants, I did not see them sleep with the migrants in a hurt. A lot of people sit on the sideline. I don't see them on 34th Street volunteering to give out food. I don't see people on the ground. I'm on the ground. If they love our migrant and asylum seekers, they need to stop being intellectual and philosophical and come and participate and help. We need a lot of volunteers, so they should come and volunteer their time. English is a second language. They should come and volunteer job training. They should come and volunteer a food service and how to navigate filling out the documents. People need to stop criticizing and lead from the front like we are. Come out and volunteer and help our migrant asylum seekers. And that's not rhetoric. That's commitment.